Jo Ibokwe reacts after Hama claimed that some passengers in the Abuja to Karuna train were informant. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. A well-known Nigerian politician, Joy Bukwe, who was a spokesperson of the All Progressive Congress APC Lagos State Chapter, has taken to his official Facebook page to react after a Twitter user identified as Hama claimed that some passengers in the Abuja to Karina train were actually infamous of a bandit that attacked the train. While sharing on his official Twitter page, Hama claimed that some passengers were actually informant to the bandit that attacked the train. Further speaking, Hama said during the attack, some passengers were pointing at passengers that would be picked, especially the VIP section. Reacting to the information, the exceptionally by serious APC supporter and special advisor to the Lagos State Governor, Babajide Samwalu, on drainage and water resources, Joy Bukwe asked if this information was true or false. Record that bandits on Monday attacked a train heading to Kaduna State from Abuja. According to information gathered from a reliable source, the bandit detonated the bomb on the road track of Abuja to Kaduna train and successfully mobilized it at a point between Qatari and Regina. However, according to Hama, he claimed that some passengers who were in the train were informed to the bandit, and that was why the operation went successfully. I don't doubt. I don't doubt it at all. I don't doubt it. You know I've been saying that. For these people to carry out a smooth operation, ha, no now. I've said it before. Sincerely, I wouldn't, I'm, I'm, I'm forced to believe this person. I am forced to believe this person. And if you watch those that died, check it out. There are those who were just shot in the leg. There are those that actually died. Haba. This thing was planned. But the thing is, everything we do is a seed. So I hope those that have sowed these seeds are going to be ready for the bountiful harvest that it is going to bring to them. This is a serious matter. Okay, somebody is saying, "Na PDP people know small story and they will fail. This is not PDP, this is a serious matter. Leave sentiment out of it and reason well. Okay, let the people wait for their daughter people to come back and answer and because of bread and butter. Some people have lost common sense. <laughs> some people have been irritated by Joy Bukwe. How does he know so? That makes him out of a terrorist sponsor. Look, I've said it before now, even before this man came out to say this, that the operation went too smooth. Who tell them where to, where they are going to be, as in where it's going to be lonely, the lonely zone? Who tell them where it's going to be lonely zone? Who tell them where to detonate the bomb? Who tell them where people were seated? <laughs> Something is not just right. There's a saying that the devil you did not invite into your house, you will drive out successfully. But the devil you invited in, you will definitely find it difficult, if not impossible, to vanquish. The Northern Light is solely responsible for this evil, simply because of their selfish and greed aspirations. Now, it's people and Nigeria by extension are suffering from it. Now, let me say this. There's also a popular saying, since we are now dealing with saying, there's also a popular saying saying that um, a house cannot be divided among itself. They said, your enemies, it is very easy for you. If you go to a war, you know your enemies, they come and tell you, let us fight it out. Do you know that's what is going to be easy to win? But you see the one that your enemy is now coming from within, is giving information to the one outside. Man, it is going to be very difficult. It will be very difficult because... You will not know. You will be relaxed. You'll be comfortable talking your plan, discussing, not knowing that as you are saying, whatever your plans, how you are going to attack, how you are going to launch an attack on your enemy, somebody is busy giving your enemy the information. That thing kills. Don't they have a manifest to reverse identify of all those on the train? Very logical. Nothing is impossible in Nigeria. I just hope that this falls the investigation and they do a very good job. We, well, we have a database with the hands of Pantami, a well-known terrorist apologist. He knows where everybody is at every time. Nigeria should not joke with this information handed to that guy. So what are you trying to say? 
It is true. No, ask yourself if this bandit is not from the north and they are using phone with NIN. <laughs> Jojo, please wake up. It is not true the attack has been planned long time ago. No any from it. Uh, yes, but I think somebody also helped them to fulfill it. Like I said. I said. Okay, um, at the end of the day, we just hope that these people that died did not die in vain and that um, they did not die in vain and whatever the case may be, whatever, who, whoever is behind this is actually caught because we, all those involved, because now we have various people. We have people who gave out the information, we have people who planned it and we have people who executed it now. When we are saying we hope those people are caught, we are saying we hope those three people, the caliber of people who were informators, the caliber of people who planned it, and the caliber of people who were executors, we wish or we pray all of them are found. And at the end of the day, they are made to pay heavenly for their crime. Fulanis are always stupid. Can you imagine what someone is thinking? In your mind, you're making sense. Me, you, or you? Oh my goodness, that is too harsh to say. PDP that left office seven years ago, evil and support of this evil government of Buhari to blur, bury their faces in shame. They all run like animals, conscienceless people. May what Buhari turns Nigeria into never sees in their life and family. People are very angry, and I don't blame them. I don't blame them at all. I do not blame them one bit. Hopefully, these people are found, they are dealt with, they are dealt with. Because to me, we cannot be facing this thing almost every time, like time and time again we are facing this. Time and time again, it is not right at all. Believe you me, it is not right. At the end of the day, these people should be fished out, they should be made, they should be used as scapegoats. So that anyone who is coming, who is going to be coming, will now... We know who is going or who is coming to do something like this or who is planning something like this would know that you don't do this and go scot free. I said it before that the way we react to some certain things is actually the cause of it staying or leaving. If you have a country like Nigeria now, in a country like Nigeria where you know things, that there's crime, and that if you close your mouth to crime, it will actually it will give room for other crime. But if crimes are committed and you pursue it and you use somebody as scapegoat, first, second, third, I think everybody head go correct. Then we're not going to be doing the net fall, which is making sure that the crimes are punished and making sure that the issues or these things are investigated and those who are actually guilty, they stand to face the law. On this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning into a lesson. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of your day.